What up, Nerd Nation? Rob back with another, not really toy review. These are candy dispenser reviews, and this is the full set. I got these from Walmart like a week ago. I was afraid if I didn't buy them then, I wouldn't see them again. I actually found them in their seasonal holiday section, more in the food area. I guess being a uh, holiday thing. They come with the Rebel, the Disney Rebels label. And they were $3 a piece. So, $12 for the full set, which I don't think is bad. They, the heads open or the tops open. And they have a little bagged candy inside. Used for the little reservoir. And then down they go. I guess $3 for a plastic thing and a couple cents worth of candy sounds a little expensive, but the cool thing about them is that they talk. Each one has a button. Fader you push right in a chest. R2-D2, chest. I actually, I actually pushed Vader twice, because... I know they make a couple different sounds. Great words of advice. Paint apps on these guys aren't bad. I think R2 was the worst. It's got a little, couple of specs here and there. I had to go through a bunch of R2s. And... Well, you can't really see... Again, I know I need a new camera. I'm going to do something this week. Maybe it was the eyes. Something was a little spotty on it. They look fine now. I like the Stormtrooper. He's actually got the. Sorry, I didn't mean to interrupt him, but he's actually got the button on the back, and just for a nifty little uh, display piece, three bucks a piece. They make great little stocking stuffers, Secret Santa stuff, whatever you guys can think of. I think last year they had something similar to this. I didn't get any of them, and they actually had little uh, holiday decorations like a Santa hat or something like that. But again, I found these at Walmart. They were $3 a piece and they were in the seasonal food section. Happy shopping.